Hi everyone, Mikasa Dragon here, and I'm super excited because not only after the patch of waiting for, well, after the patch of getting new heroes, which I finally got, we also have, they also added an auto clicker into the game, and we're going to talk about both of those right now. So since the, the heroes came first, I'm going to talk about them first. So as you can see, the first hero doesn't, you don't get into like 6.8 E499, and that's a huge gap difference between like, like this is, I feel like since Transcended, <coughs> this is like the beginning of a new end game. Because how much you have to do is so big and so far beyond any of these heroes. That's just like super extreme. <coughs> Zone 6800. <coughs> Excuse me. I think I didn't get him until like zone. Probably zone 6000 around. And th these are my ancients right now. So I'm pretty capped out right now. And it's taking forever for me to even get one hero uh, transcendent soul. So, good thing about this dude super strong. Bad thing, you don't get your skills till level 1000. Next one, I have no clue, and I don't know about the other two, sadly. Research on that is going to take me a lot longer. You're probably going to have to watch another YouTube video on that. Um, and then, the, this is why I think this is a new late game. Because, like, the next hero is not until 5.4 E999. You're basically, I don't even know. And if you look here, there's more and more and more. So it's like they're expecting a lot from us since Transcended. So you just gotta grind like crazy. And I think Pony Boy is gonna help you out with that. Pony Boy and Bart. Keep these like every 10 levels into Pony Boy, put one into Bart. And then, like, after a while, you put one in. One extra point into uh, whoever this guy is. Uh, idle damage, it falls off. You don't really need it. So level eight's good enough. Uh, cord, you can level this up if you want. I'm probably gonna leave it at this level because I just want that Solomon, man. Like, not putting a point in Solomon kills me. Uh, all right. Since we got all those out the way, let's talk about the auto clicker. Auto clicker, if you already use an auto clicker, it's still highly advised, highly advised to use this auto clicker. It only costs, I think, a hundred to start out with, and every time you buy one, it costs fifty more. So, why is it so highly advised to use this auto clicker? For the main reason of relics, you know, when you ascend. And you know you have to go, but you just ascended and you, and you and you do your stuff. Um, if you're using an auto clicker, your auto clicker won't work once you kill that monster that gives you that relic, and the relic symbol pops up. This in-game auto clicker is underneath that text, so it keeps going. And you can have more than one. So you can have one on this hero, which I do. It's 10 clicks per second. And then you can have one here, or you can put one on this dude. But the only bad thing about it is when you ascend, you have to, they all go back. So you can't just have him permanently upgraded, boost yourself all the way up to that point, and then upgrade him. And then the auto clicker upgrades him. So you have to unlock the character you, you want to have the auto clicker on. And these, for the click area, they do stack. So as you can see, one, two, and we're gonna stop that because we don't we don't need it. Um, I don't know why my music stopped. All right, there we go. Other than that, uh, so far from what I know, yeah, you can do this. You can visit store, get the DLC click. Um, 
there's no limit so you can have like a hundred clicks per second a thousand clicks per second ten thousand clicks per second that would probably get old because doing this you have to you have to click and drag it every single one so after a while it will get old so hopefully they add something for that also i did say in my last click your heroes video that there was um a new level up icon or whatever animation new level up animation but when i click level up there's nothing there on steam on a browser it still works but on steam there's nothing so hopefully they fix that bug i should have mentioned that sooner but i completely forgot my bad other than that keep leveling up guys just just grind it out i've been playing for like over a year now and it, it just it's, it's nice to feel a change but you know I've gotten used to the change but now this is like even better this solves all the issues like when you're going uh, click build and use an auto clicker the issue is you have to pause and unpause the auto clicker and put it there now we have it other people use like a macro program or whatever and it moves everything for them me I like being on my computer doing stuff so having the auto clicker is super super good uh, other than that tell me what you guys think about this new auto clicker me personally I can see it being a little broken with an auto clicker uh, and then to your progression your this just makes you progress as high as possible with you being there or not so in my opinion I like it little little I'm good like other people like oh you, you don't really have to macro anymore with this you can just like have an auto clicker hit here and have your other auto clicks there they'll probably just macro it in it's just like in this time and do this and I'm just like damn tell me what you guys think I'll see you guys in the next video and like, comment, share, and subscribe. See you next time. Oh yeah, and one more thing I forgot is that you can add the auto clicker onto your skills. So yeah, you can keep this going a long time. Alright, thanks for watching.